wise choice. Hey guys, and welcome to this. All right, folks, we're mere hours into this new patch 10.10, .10, folks. And I thought, first deck, how can I go past the very card I got to reveal? The Reaver Hunters. The Reaver Boys! Folks, I think this is a pretty, pretty good deck. Certainly, this early on in the patch, who's to say? I'm sure you could make improvements, but so far, it's done me pretty well, folks. So let's see what we got. The idea is, of course, round three, we want to get as many of these boys as possible. The Reaver Hunters, of course, they go on the melee row when bonded. Damage the highest uh, power enemy unit by one. Order ability spawn uh, another copy, basically, folks. So how do we get more, 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 more of these? Well, through Boholt. Boholt, another new card, very nice indeed. Usually... I use this on the ranged row to not clog up that melee row. Um, also, you put down your bow halt, you play your mobilization, party time. Also, your garrison and your mushy truffle, while uh, resilient locations provide great carryover, but also will get you more of these Reaver Hunter boys. And the, the garrison order ability, great little finisher as well, folks. Boosting all your Reaver boys by one and giving them one armor as well. Queen Adalia, same thing. Get you another one. Uh, Roach is here for thinning. Sensational. Voimir, another good little finisher. Much like Garrison, does the same thing. Uh, the order ability, that is. The order ability of Garrison, that is. Uh, reinforcements, get you another one. You got your two prime boys. You got your Vial of Forbidden Knowledge. Eh, it's okay. Sintra and Envoy, good little proactive play, can fix up your draws for later on in the piece. Squirrel, you might find value out of. Uh, Reaver Scouts, the other new card. Uh, it's slow, but it can get you more Reaver Hunters, of course, as well. These are good little proactive plays, the Royal Guards and the, uh, the Redanian Knights as well there. Now, we also play the other new Northern Realms card, Kenneth and Gar. Formation, order ability, destroy an enemy unit with two or less power. Whenever you spawn a soldier, increase the limit by one. So we do a lot of spawning. If you play this early on, you can get pretty good value. I don't know. Because I like to get down my Reaver Hunters ASAP to get that beautiful bonded action. Which means you're not playing Kennet and Gar that early. So... It's up to you. Try it out. I thought this first deck we're going to try every single new Northern Realms card for heaven's sakes. Being Boholt, Kennet and Gar, and of course the Reaver Hunters and the Reaver Scouts. Now, I hear you. Hey Briefs, how are you going to survive round one? Well, that's where our King Foltest comes in. So we also play a Crystal Skull. So if we're going first, we can uh, protect Foltest just a bit. We also want to protect Foltest with Donomir of Troy. Get your Troy down, get your Fault Test down, put down the Dun Banner in front of the Fault Test. It's a great little engine piece, great thinning. Going to be hard for them to take care of business. I think that's about it, folks. Why don't we just get into the into the meat and potatoes of it? Uh, let's do it. Let's do it right. Let's do it right now. All righty. Let's see what these uh, these southern savages bring to the table in this new patch here, folks. Alrighty, what do we got? What do we got access to here, for heaven's sakes? Uh, a lot of bronze action. Don't care for that. So we got no access to the foal test. All I can say is thank heavens that we're going second, folks, because we're going to need that breathing space. Okay, so we might just... You know, a bit of century and envoy action. Fix up our draws a touch. Yes, that might be for the best. Them with them oh, with all brick styles, huh? Okay. Yeah, I think we're just going to play it slow ball here, folks, to be honest with you. So, uh, we can play the vial of forbidden knowledge, I suppose. Um, hmm, this is pesky business. Pesky business, if I ever saw it. Okay, there's the fold test. We'll put that on the top deck. 
And that'll do. Get out the roach. Very nice indeed. All right. Um, and uh, what else can we do? Nothing really worth squirreling at this stage. I guess we could play the squirrel. Just to dump it. Uh, perhaps not. Perhaps not. All right, we're going to play that. Give Roach a bit of a booster there. I think we're going to bow out here, folks. To be honest with you, that's okay. We're, we're, we're okay with that. We're going to have to be. We're going to have to make peace with it. Let's see if this fella draws us into a big old bleed in that round two situation. So, we will have the fall test. We would like the Donomir, to be honest with you, to protect that fall test. We have the Dun Banner. Mm, I think we're going to need that little interaction to survive this probable round two bleed. So, uh, we don't want to... We don't want to brick things here, folks. Uh, okay. Okay. No fall test. Uh, sorry, no Donomir. No old mate Donomir. Didn't get the memo to come out of Troy, for heaven's sakes. We need you, son. Mm okay. Uh, what to do here? Yeah, what to do? Okay, let's do this. I think that's a heck of an opening play in this round two situation. What do you say to that, folks? What are you, what are you gonna bring to the table here, fella, now, huh? Come on. You got your carry over. I'm sure you're very proud of yourself. Now, is it a critical moment here, folks? Critical moment. Will he, uh, will he continue the bleed action? Uh, let's see if he's got an answer to the fault test, for heaven's sakes. It's a bit of a commitment. He might be happy to see the fault test out. Okay. Well, he's playing on, but he hasn't taken care of the fault test. You know what that means, folks? We can get out these done banners. Just like the good Lord intended, and all in accordance with those holiest of scriptures. Always. But... He's putting out a ton of points. Cause for concern, folks. Settle down there, settle down. Fall test by the skin of his teeth. Okay. Oh, man, we're gonna need a miracle here, for heaven's sakes. Yes. Mm. Well, uh, what's... All right, Garrison Styles. On to Reaver Hunters. Let's see if he's got an answer to that, shall we, Fags? Yes, indeed. Okay, so on the range row, the Dun Banners are committed to that. You know, the garrison's going to be okay, certainly, on all these Dun Banners. As you command. Okay, but he's uh, getting a ton of points here. A ton of points. Um, now what? Well, that's reinforcement styles. Don't recognize your old mates. Okay. So now we got the bonded action on that. Start hitting down that snowdrop. We get the grace eight on the Redanian Knight there, folks, and we're still 20 points behind. Unbelievable. Redanian Archer takes care of the fall test. Certainly. Surely. No? He's employing a strategy I've not yet seen. Perhaps he's hoping I brick myself? Potentially. 
Okay, okay, we're getting five points a turn out of these beautiful Reaver Hunter boys. Plus the Dun Banners. Got room for one more on that ranged row. Why are you doing that? Curious. Very curious indeed. But, uh, yeah, he's kind of drawing out all my, uh... All my stuff here, folks, and I really don't care for it. Uh, we're running out of room here, folks. Um. Hmm. Okay, let's put uh, Voimir on the top deck there. That'll do. Uh, but yeah, we're running out of space here for heaven's sakes, folks. Uh, I think he's given us a pass here just quietly. Thanks to our Reaver Hunter boys. Yes, indeed. Okay. So we got the carryover down to six. Very nice indeed, but he did get a heck of a lot of stuff out of us. Uh, but we got the carryover of the garrison. We still have the Adalia, the mushy truffle. Voimir, and hero's great. Squirrel. I don't care for that. Okay, I guess uh, I guess with the Aneromancy we go for old mate Boholt. What do you say to that? I think uh, I think that's pretty good. Yes, I do. So, what's the order of operations here? Let's go the Queen of Dahlia. Onto the Raver Hunters. Um... Uh, Uh, okay, let's start getting the value straight away for heaven's sakes, folks. Let's do that. Okay, that'll do. Next, I think, yeah, we want to get Boholt down. Certainly, certainly. He may not have an answer to it. I expect we're going to see uh, Vilgefort. He's going to have a ton of points here for heaven's sakes, and we've got a useless squirrel. So let's get that Boholt. Uh, do we want the formation? How full is our melee row going to get here? Could get a touch full. Yeah, let's go the formation. Gets a bit of a booster immediately. Yeah, up to seven points there. Sensation ability, folks. Then we get four points a turn out of these boys. Okay... Okay, okay, sure, sure, sure. No problem, Santa. All right, well, let's uh, let's just continue. Let's mushy truffle styles. Get a couple more Reba boys. Well, one, yeah, you know, next turn it'll be another one. But that's five points a turn. Real unfortunate about this squirrel business. Mm -mm. That's a lot of points. A lot of points. So we put that down, we put that down. We may as well go for the garrison here, folks. Oh no, we could get, no. Steady on, we can get one more Reaver Hunter next turn, then we'll, uh, then we'll trigger the ability of the garrison there. Zarthesius, big points, big points. Oh, oh, did you want that to happen, son? Did you want that to happen, I wonder? Either way, he's got a big old, big old lead on us here, folks. So we play the Voimir. We do the garrison here, folks. Beautiful, beautiful. And Mushy Truffle, I guess, can wait just a touch. Nah, we'll do it. Okay, okay. Oh. Thing of beauty, folks. I think we should still quite handily have it here. Did it, did it, did it, did Mario level boss. And it's as easy as that, folks. And we'll destroy that Davik of our novice there, very nice indeed. Oh, okay, okay. That was a little, uh, little squirrely there, but 
Let's go for it again, folks. What do you say? Let's go. Okay. Imprisonment, huh? Lockage. Don't care for that. Okay, but we do have the Crystal Skull. Now, we need our full test, please. So we got one done banner. We don't need two, that's for sure. There's the full test. You'll love to see that. Uh, what don't we really need at this juncture? I suppose we'll get rid of those boys. All right, so... Does he have an answer for a nine-point veiled King Fall test straight off the bat? Or do we potentially, and I think we might, want to go for that beautiful protection in the Donomir of Troy? I think that might be worthwhile, folks. Yes, indeed. All right, come on. Do you have an answer to that, I wonder? I think that's a heck of an opening play, don't you? So, uh, what you got, Teaser Jack One, you hungry beak, you? Spotter Stars. Okay, it's okay. Sure. Alrighty, so let's get down. Yes. Let's get down the fall test, for heaven's sakes. Give it a booster. Protect, you know, treason could have taken care of the fall test there. So you can't be too careful with Treason still being able to uh, to target the defenders, of course. So, uh, yeah, look, I think we should be safe to put down the Dun Banner next there, next to the Foul Test. And uh, we just get those ticking, those boys, onto the battlefield post-haste. So uh, what else can we do? The Redanian Knights, they also require the ranged row. Um, hmm... What are you going to do, son? You're running out of time here, Chief. Your move! Slave driver. Okay, okay. Might be, uh, might be playing a bit slow ball. It's well within his right to do so. Okay, Dan Banners, enter the fray. Yes, indeed. All right. So in terms of what we do next here, folks, we could, uh, we could, uh, yeah. Put down the century and envoy on the melee row there. But otherwise, otherwise, not much. But I would wager, folks, just quietly, I think this fella might be, uh, to, what? Ooh, okay, okay. Let's get this over with. I thought he might be preparing for a, uh, an exit. That's a big old play. That's okay. Uh, fall test, you did your duty. You got out our dun banners. And you uh, tempted out the Igni. So, and you've done us a favour there, Chief. Now we got the space for the Redanian Knight. So we get those boys ticking. Put down the other one. Maybe work our way slowly up to that grey sight. And uh, the Cinturin Envoy we can put down as well. Uh, oh, okay, okay, he took our Neromancy, fair play to him! Uh, that rascal Xavier Lemons. Really chaffing my chaps. Look, he's keeping up this fella, he really is. Okay, so we can't rely on the, uh, on the Neromancy, that's okay. We can try to fix things up with the Sentry and Envoy just a touch. Okay, lose out on three damage there. Yeah, what? Oh, the Vandermaster. Oh. Sure. Okay, okay. Mmm. This fella. Yes, okay. Nah, I don't want any of that. Thank you so much. Okay, he's, uh, we're barely ahead here, folks. Barely ahead. We got one leader charge out of him. That's worth celebrating. But, uh, ah, one of these types! Greedily having another uh, bite at the apple, as they say. Um, I guess we can play the Voimir for eight. Uh, what to do, what to do? Mm. 
Got to do something, for heaven's sakes. All right, we'll do that. Ready. Ready. Giving this fella a pass. He can take it if he wants. I'm quite, I would be quite fine with it. Going down two cards. If it means we can just eke our way to round three, no matter what it takes. He's still safe. These won't hit that Grace 8 just yet. But what are you going to do, fella? Hmm? What are you going to bring to the table? I really thought I uh, would have... Okay. I would have had this round in hand. But alas. Oh, well. Uh, we're going to go for the Reaver Hunters here. Uh, again, I don't really want any of that. Thank you. Mm-hmm. I don't want to use leader. I would really rather not. So I'm not gonna. I won't do it, folks! Okay. So I could even commit the bow halt. I really could. Uh, you know, okay. Well, hang on a second, hang on a second. We get two. That's going to hit the Grace 8, so 4, right? No, hang on, yeah, 1, 2, boost adjacent, 3, 4, and then that would trigger the Grace 8, right? I think. Yes, indeed! Beautiful, all right. Okay, we made it out by the skin of our teeth. Now, we do need to draw the other Reaver Hunters for the likes of Queen Adalia, of course. We don't have that Aniromancy to rely on as well. And that Sintra and Envoy, you did nothing for me. Squirrel, are you any good for us? Uh, no, I don't. I think not. So we'll get rid of that, yeah. Excellent. And we'll get rid of that. And we're going to take that dry pass. Okay, it's got one leader charge remaining, but we know it's a reverie deck. Uh, we also know we don't really need to be concerned about special cards, folks. So that could be worth celebrating. So, what do we want? We want, our, uh, we want our locations, please. Queen of Dali would be great. Uh, reinforcements could be okay. Good. Yeah. Okay. Envoy, you're doing nothing for me now. That's great. Uh, that would be bad. But everything else would be okay. I think we can... Okay. Okay. Okay, okay. Well, we just want to uh, we want to get the proceedings underway just as soon as we can here, folks. So, uh, what we could do... What do we want to do? Reaver Scouts. They're really slow. They're really slow. Um. Mm-hmm. All right, let's do this. Onto the Reaver Hunters, of course. And, uh, yeah, we're going to go ahead and use later right now. I know we lose out on just a touch value uh, from the bow halt. But uh, don't worry, we can put the bow halt down and then we get, uh, we can, as long as they're not <laughs> uh, out of play or locked, like this fella does, uh, we can, uh... okay, two locks, huh? This guy, really chaffing my chaps here like nobody's business. That's okay. Now we put this down. So it's still going to benefit from the bonded, even though these boys are locked. It's hitting armor, which, you know... <laughs> okay, here's the rune mage. He's going to try to find another lock, or even worse, an amnesty. Okay. And then he goes for the big old 
The big old, uh, big old play. Now these Reaver Scouts, like I say, are really slow ball. Uh, we want to play the Bow Holtz pretty soon, we'll, but we don't want to uh, overstack our front row. So best case scenario, how many Reaver Hunters can we get on this row? Quite a few. One, yeah, uh, mm, 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 mm. yeah, we're going to go for the range row formation here. Yeah, 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 yeah. We trigger that. Very nice indeed. Get that up to five. Golden Froth, I don't know if that's really worthwhile at this stage. I suppose it could be. No, we'll, we'll wait, we'll wait. We'll wait till we got some more Reaver Hunter boys. The boat halt. Okay. Now, he might go for the destroy an enemy unit with eight power here. He may go for that. Play a bronze unit and draw a unit of your choice. Okay. It's going to be tight. And these Reaver Scouts, they're really slow. Really slow. As is the Vial of Forbidden Knowledge as well. Uh, oh, well, look, our game plan is pretty much set here, folks. Um... Yeah, it really is. We play these other Reaver Hunters. We play the Reaver Scouts. Finish with the Voimir, I suppose. And, uh, you know, we still got the Golden Froth and the Garrison as well. So, what's this? What's this new card? Oh, you bush. Dario! Don't care for it. Come on, just let me have my fun, fella. Uh, Okay, what's this do? When it gets to Grace 8, boost all allied units. Boost all, it says boost all units by one. Okay. Okay. Um, yeah, okay, we do that. We do that. And I think it might be time for the Golden Froth folks. Protect these boys just a touch, for heaven's sakes. Okay, so now we're getting three points per turn off these Reaver Hunter boys. Might keep uh, this Knight Challenger in check as well. Yes. It's a tight, tight points here, but like I say, these Reaver Scouts, we've got to get them down. They're really slow, real slow. Good for the bow halt, I suppose. Yeah, that's pretty good, pretty good, pretty good. Mm. Okay, Reaver Scout. Now we uh, trigger these. Very good for the bow hold. Big 14 pointer. Now we get the five points a turn from these Reaver boys. Okay, okay. I mean, he might have a big old, a big old answer to uh, to our poor bow hold here. Um, and I fear, unless he destroys some boys like he just did, we may have. Uh, Actually run out of space on the melee row, but he's taking care of business the old-fashioned way. Okay, okay. So we're getting four points a turn here now. Keeping that Knight Challenger in check as well, folks. But does he have a big old answer to the bow halt? Could be a Vilga Forts. Who knows, folks? Ooh. Damn, that's good. That's real good. That's going to hit the grace, eh? Boost all units. We're down 31 points, folks. Heaven's sakes. Uh, don't like our chances. Now we may as well use the garrison. Uh, unless. You don't play a sneaky Urden by chance, do you, fella? Um. Yeah, I guess we can hold off. Oh, I got a play card. Whoops. All right, we'll do the vial. Although if he did a, he does. If he has Erden, he would go for the range bro Erden, wouldn't he? So we may as well go to Garrison there. Very nice and deep. Very nice and deep. Oh, okay. That was. Ooh, not a big, uh, not a big finishing play, but he's still got a decent lead. Oh yeah, I should have held off on the garrison there. My mistake, folks. We still had another one, another boy. But I think we might have it here, folks. Did it, did did it, did. Mario level boss. Was it ever in doubt, folks? Never, ever in doubt. Let's do it, but one more time, please. Let's go. 
All right. What do we got? The uh, the uh, blaze of glory, folks. These island dwelling savages. All right. What do we got? We got the fall test. We got the darn banner, folks. We got the Donamere. Yes. Sensation ability. Well, I don't want to draw the roach or the other done banner. Yeah, okay, that'll do. That'll do. Okay, okay, folks. Well, look, we are... We are... Gonna go straight into the Donamere of Troy, just like that. And we can put down the foal test and start getting down these done banners, for heaven's sakes. Hercule Drummond. Nice. Nice little engine piece. All right. Um, I don't see, unless, he wouldn't waste a leader. Surely not. I think we can hold off, I think we can hold off on the crystal skull just quietly, just at this moment. If he wants to play his leader, well, that's on this chap. He's deciding something, some dastardly deed. Fabjorn. Stunning Blore. Nearly got him. Mm-hmm. Okay. Okay, folks. Well, now let's get these done banners going. And I think we really need to protect... Uh, old mate Donamere. Just quietly. Gets him up to six. He still could have an answer to it, but then uh, King Foltest, you've already done the Lord's work for us here, Chief. You've got out the Dunbanners. Okay, okay, Highland Warlord. Yes, yeah, setting things up. Not bad, not bad. Well, while Donamere is still amongst the living, why don't we try to fix up our drawers just a touch, shall we, folks? Uh, garrison, don't mind if I do. Very nice indeed. Okay, good, 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 good little engine pieces. We may see a pass shortly, folks. Perhaps. But, you know, good to get out the Hercule. Good to get out the Vabjorn, certainly. Uh, would have been good to have, actually have Squirrel in hand, just quietly. Oh, well. Um, uh, let's see. Well, let's play the Vile of Forbidden Knowledge. Boost up King Foltesh there. I think he's earned it. I think any fair-minded viewer of mine would agree. He's certainly earned the Vile of Forbidden Knowledge. Yes, indeed. All right, decent lead. He takes the pass. Very nice indeed. All right. So, that's good. Uh, we're down to 13 cards. We know we're drawing the garrison. We could play the garrison. For a bit of sweet, sweet carryover. Um, Adalia is good. Mm. Alrighty, so we'll get rid of that. That's, yep, yeah, that's a card. Uh, okay, okay. Uh, yeah, I'm going to play the garrison just for that beautiful, uh, beautiful carryover, folks. And, uh, yeah, we'll go for the Redanian Knight. Good little engine piece, good little engine piece. I've got no doubt that this fella is going to be able to take care of business. But, uh, it's a viable threat. Go ahead. In two cards, can he beat the beautiful value of this one Redanian Knight? Time will tell, folks. But we will be taking a pass. So, uh, what do we want? We want the Boholt, the Mushy Truffle. The Aneromancy would be grand. Okay, we're going to take that pass. Meet this fella mano a mano in round three, folks. Both leader charges, both intact. Okay. Come on. All right. Uh, yes. Squirrel. No, I don't think so. Get rid of that and... Uh, Okay, Neuromancy will be... Ooh. 
The mushy truffle and bow halt are both pretty sensational. Um, I think we... Okay, okay. No! Don't clog up. Alright, what do we got? Death wish. Boost the enemy serve twice by own base power. Okay. I don't care that you're clogging up my uh, melee row there, Chief! Um, but so be it. For now. Right. Uh, let's see. Let's see. Well, we want to get the party started just as soon as possible, don't we, folks? So... Go for the Reaver Hunter, boys. And... Can he take care of it? It does have a shield. Ah, uh, no, we'll go for it. Because I want to I wanna get that bonded straight away, folks. Get that beautiful value. So I hope he, you know, triggers this, uh, this death wish on the Raging Bear. Quite frankly, he's got no place on this side of the battlefield, for heaven's sakes. I've got the most highly trained dragon hunters here, the Reaver Hunters. The Crinfred Reavers! And there's a, there's a bear on the battlefield. Unbelievable. Alright. Now then, let's continue with the festivities here. So yeah, I think we will go for the Aneromancy here, folks. Onto the Boholt. And usually... I like to play this on the ranged to not clog, but I dare say he's gonna die like immediately. So we're gonna get his value straight away, straight away, straight away, up to eight. Sensation ability. Uh, that's pretty good. That's, I'm happy with that, folks. Okay, all right, so we got five a turn. At some point, he's gonna take care of Bow Holt, I just know it. And he's going to want to take care of this raging bear as well. Now, what else are we going to do? We got the reinforcements. We got the two prime reaver hunters. Yeah, we actually kind of need this fella to start killing off some of our reaver hunters to make room for more. Mate. There's always always room for more. Okay, there's leader. Takes care of Boholt, just as I suspected. But we got the value out of him anyhow, folks. Yes, indeed. Um, ba, 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 ba. Do we want to get this Kenneton Gar down, I wonder? Uh, I kind of just want to keep <laughs> putting down the Reaver Hunters, quite frankly, folks. So let's do just that. You'll love to see that. Alright, so we're trailing just a touch, but that's okay. Getting beautiful five points a turn. Feral Bond. Okay. I don't know what happened there? What? Sure. Sure. Alrighty. Let's get some more Reaver Hunters, shall we, folks? Into the proceedings. Uh, but, uh, yeah. Start killing them off, please. Because uh, I need the space. And take care of this raging bear. Get it out of there! Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, there's a raging bear. Okay, okay, okay. This fella's got quite the lead on us. Quite the lead. Okay. Well. Um. Let's put down Kennet. See if he's got an answer to that. I dare say this fella will. That's okay. We're now getting eight points a turn from the Reaver Hunters. Onto that enemy Sove. A new Sove chap. On crate raiders. Well, that's going to take care of one of them, surely. Uh, so now we can destroy something. We certainly can do that. Um, I guess we put down this. It's slow, and these poor Redanian knights are going to be real slow as well. Uh, can he take care of Kenneth? There's nothing really worth taking care of. I'm, I'm happy to let him <laughs> live his life, for heaven's sakes. Have they not been through enough? So, yeah, we guess I guess we want a reinforcements on a Reaver Hunters. 
Ossipage. I also want to get that. Oh no, because we're going to get something from the Reaver Scout as well. Alright, we want to get down these Redanian Knights for heaven's sakes. Bear in mind, we've still got the order ability of the garrison as well. We're trailing, but we might be okay. I don't know what more to expect. He might use this order ability to take care of one of our Reaver Hunter boys. But that's okay. So what else, Chief? And he's still got this, uh, it's the, the, you know, the, the, whatever that is. The Brock Vale Warrior. Mm. Sure. Okay, okay. Not a problem. Okay. Let's get another one of these, for heaven's sakes. Now we've got the full garrison of nine Reaver Hunters. This uh, can do four. Is it worth it? It may be. Because, yeah, at most we're going to get more, one, one more. Let's take care of this east to a sec, please. Um, I guess I could use the garrison. Why not? Why not indeed? Very nice. Okay. Nine points of damage a turn. Very nice. Uh, unfortunately, these Redanian Knights are very slow. Even cards. Leaders out of play. Sure. Okay, okay. This armor doing the Lord's work for us. Okay, we put that down. Gonna have a great finisher in the Voimir, no doubt about that. Nine points of damage a turn from the Reaver Hunter boys. We may just be okay. Now what? Feral Bond. Sure. Weak source. Weak source. Okay, we get one of them. I don't know what's happening, to be honest. Uh, oh, yeah. What's it do? I don't, know. I don't know. But this armor, doing the Lord's work for us, folks. All in accordance with those holiest of scriptures. Beautiful nine points a turn, folks. All right, final card. What you got? Get ready for it, folks. Did it, did it, did it, did it. Mario level boss! Sensation ability, folks. Love these boys. Love them. I'm very, very glad I got this as my very first reveal, these Reaver Hunters. you love to see it. Folks, it's very early. We're mere hours into this patch. I'm sure you can tinker with it and improve it. But uh, as you can see, ton of fun. So why don't you give it a try? And uh, thanks for watching. Cheers.